I'm Renton Bishopric and this is my behind the scenes pottery workshop. Yeah, all the clay we use here is Australian clay. So an interesting fact is clay is actually the only resource, natural resource on the planet that's been created faster than humans are using it. Wedging clay is a similar process to kneading dough, although with clay you're trying to get the air out and with bread you're trying to put the air in. So that's why you can see as I'm wedging this, this is called a ram's head technique and it creates a spiral and shoots the air out the side of each side of those little seams there. So that's us. Let's make a bowl. With Pottery for the Planet, our big ambition now is to, is to just truly commit to our footprint as a business, proving just how possible it is to run a business plastic free. Well, the most important thing with the bowl is your setup. You need to get it, you make sure you're really centered because as centrifugal force comes into play, if it's not centered at the beginning, it soon becomes very apparent as your rim doubles in size. Clay is prone to cracking in the middle here if you don't compress it properly as it shrinks. Once you're accomplished to pottery, you j you're not, it just happens. You're like it, it's, I guess it's like, my father's always said, mate, pottery is a bit like playing the saxophone. It's easy when you know how. The bowls are fun because from this point they happen really quickly. I love making bowls. Um, there's a few reasons. In the, the actual making process is um, fantastic because it happens quickly. It's like an explosion before your eyes, which I love. It's magic. Um, and I guess another part of it is that you know that a bowl like this thinking forward to the finished product being on someone's table, that will hold some amazing meal, salad, fruit salad, dessert, or something that's just gonna be shared by people, having fun and, and enjoying the work of, of um, pottery. So, you know, what's not to love about that? us. She's done. That